Hey there, friends. Got a bluey reaction for you. Come on, kids, let's go. Oh, motor. heck. Why do we always have to motor? So we can get a good oh, spot on the we going to back to, to camping? There? A long time. What if I get bored? Then you get bored. Oh. Hey, you haven't packed the kids' stuff yet. Oh, that car was already look. Yeah, they don't really have a big trunk for all their stuff, huh? But wait, they went camping before, right? The Jean-Luc episode, they were camping at that time, right? Yeah, they were, so they're going camping again. Maybe we might see Jean-Luc then, and I, I, I don't know, maybe, but it seems like this episode might be going, might be about going there. Eh, I was just gonna bang it down by their feet. Are you sure? Oh my this? The kids goodness. Stuff. Oh, biscuits. The kids yeah, have a lot of stuff. Road trip! Oh, wow. Wait, what? No, we're not there yet. Oh, but yeah, look at that. They got a lot of stuff right there. But wait, great what? But also, you gotta have that kid that's like, are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? A lot of that. It's too real. Oh, but I'm born. You're born? I know you're born. <laughs> Look, because I'm such a champion, I brought the tablets so you kids could play tablets. Hang on, where are they? Who, who, what kind of child does that though? I want to know what kind of kid just says yay computer games. But the thing is, for parents out there, if you give your kids tablets, make sure you limit how long they're on, otherwise they get addicted to it. So basically, giving them tablets on like a road trip is good, so they don't complain the whole way. They get distracted for just a trip, then take away the tablet until you're going back. Don't let your child become a tablet kid. They get distracted easily. Uh, they must be in the booth. That's all they, they want. Find a place to pull over. What? I know I oh. them. They gotta take out everything again. What is that? Oh no! We gotta go. But Wait. Wait, what's the problem? Oh, nomads! That was too close. Oh, basically like motor, motor, motorhomes, basically RVs, stuff like that. So I take it that Bandit wants to get there quicker, but if he stays behind the gray nomads, then the trip will be much longer because he's already driving faster than the gray nomads. That makes sense. You want to get to the campsite as quickly as possible, also to get a good space. What are Grey Nomads? The nanas and granddads in big, slow caravans. We'll get stuck behind them, we'll be the last to the campsite, and we'll have to camp next to the toilet block. Ew. I like the Grey Nomads. Their horns are funny. But what about the tablet? The tablet! <laughs> Oh, wow. Plenty of non-computer games we can play. Non-computer? Oh, no, not non-computer games. But also, can you last a whole trip to the campsite, though? And plus, I feel like somehow, some way, they're going to end up behind the Great Nomads. They brought them up for a reason. But Bandit did give him a good explanation. The, the the granddads and the grandmoms of vehicles basically they they are slow and if you're behind them yeah good luck might be up four hours worth games like four what? hours games like i spy yeah me first okay but they have to drive for four hours it's boring when it's too easy okay wow something colored me. Yes. <laughs> no, it's Bandit. It's your dad. <laughs> Don't make it too easy. Makes it the easiest game ever. Oh my goodness, that's amazing. But the thing is... Like, in long car trips, kids have to get distracted by something. They can only get distracted so long with a toy or a book. Tablets or a lifesaver? Tablets, games, like Nintendo Switches and stuff like that, they are a lifesaver. Also, if they had, if their vehicle had like a DVD player at the top, you know, like how some cars do, if they had a car with a DVD player, 
they be set. They would be set if they had a DVD player in their vehicle. Uh, please, can I play computer games? What's so fun about them? Well, there's one where you have to make Chunky Chin jump over barrels. You don't need computers Is that to play jumping Donkey games. Kong? Just use your fingers. Whoop, whoop. That's creative. <laughs> Where are the uh, yeah, barrels? You can jump. <laughs> oh. oh my goodness. It's like video games, but real. Video games are real. If you lose in, if you lose in the video game, you lose in real life. <gasps> that that is cute though. I mean, Chili is doing a great job trying to distract these kids for four hours. <laughs> Oh, yeah, man. Oh, wait. That, well, oh, that's a lot of cows. The, ew. All right, this is not an actual stop, family, so everyone just stay. Yeah, that's not going to happen. If you sit in the car for a long time and you go to a stop, the first thing you want to do is actually get out of the car. Have you ever been in a long car ride and then the moment you get out, your legs, your legs, you feel like you gotta get your legs out there. I wish I knew that feeling because I'm a fish, but I've heard. I've heard. All right. Those things. Those things. There's nothing boring about this, <laughs> is there, Bluey? No. This guy. Oh. What? The gray nomad. Oh my goodness, that's actually really funny. We're still making good time. Ooh, I want to see the big peanut. But yeah, it's it's just funny that they that Bandit really doesn't want to be the last one there. Cuz if you're stuck behind them, you are stuck, but I find it funny that literally the the enemy of the trip are the slow drivers. The freaking slow drivers. Mom, have you got another car game? Look, I'm a bit out of <gasps> Wait, try right. Oh? Nice job, Chili. Good, good, lucky you. Chili was about to give up right there. Oh. Hello, road worker dog. He's just bored. It makes sense. You're getting paid to hold up a sign and stay there. That's literally your job for the whole day. Can you imagine that? Just staying in one spot the entire time and just doing the same thing over and over and over again. I need the toilet. Okay, come on, I'll take you for the a toilet. Push. Don't be long. <laughs> we'll be as long as we need, thank you. Yeah, don't rush the Wii. Mom, do you know any Bush Wii games? Bush Wii oh, games? I'm all out of games, sweetheart. Oh, but I'm bored. Look, Bluey, sometimes you're just gonna be bored. But what do I do about it? You just mm. be bored. I mean, I can see why Chili is saying this, but at the same time, being bored, it, you just you just gotta be bored. I mean, understandable. You gotta teach the kid that sometimes there's nothing you can really do, and being bored just happens. But being bored really, really stinks, though. But I, I like props to Bluey for trying to come up with a Bushwee game, like. What does that mean? What 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 kind of game do you play when you're having a wee in a bush? You know, look around. Something always pops up. Looking on the brighter side of life. Crumb steak. Chill the beans. He's still behind us. The guy hasn't turned the side yet. He's turning it. Oh my goodness. Just in time though. But yeah, you can't really rush a bushweed bandit. I mean, I get why, but still, you can't rush a bushweed. Do you really want some of that weed to get back in the car? I'm sure you don't want that. Oh, Oh no! They're going to pet. Oh, they're waving. Oh, Bandit is, he's in, he's in pain, he's in pain. Finished. And the, and he's got to wait again, it's on stop. But what's the work? It's, 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 oh my goodness. They didn't have to do that, like, 
slowly drive through, waving hi to Bandit, and Bandit's like, like he he is poor Bandit. <laughs> <laughs> now he's gotta wait. I like the Great Nomad stickers. <sighs> Bored again. It's only been like five minutes. Hmm, oh. Never seen that before. So. Oh. Oh my goodness, the pause. The pause. <laughs> Did Bluey not know about the about the hidden card compartment? But look, the tablets are there. But the thing is, have they been charged? So it's like, yeah, they have the tablets, but imagine the battery's also dead. Bingo! A table! This has been here all along. They did not oh, wait. The tablets oh, though. The tablets! The tablets near the table. Oh wow! Do you wanna play computer games? Uh no, I wanna play petrol station. Oh, yeah, would you like to buy some sunny? Oh my goodness, that's that is really funny though. It's like, oh my goodness, there's a table! Do you want to play the tablets? What's a tablet? I want to play with the table. That is funny though. It's like I thought they're not gonna realize the tablets, but the thing is, they are kids. It's like it's a good thing too, because you know, for them, they could easily be distracted by tablets, but these are kids who grew up by playing games. So it's dumb. A table just means a new game for them. So it's like, these are good parents. They're, it's good parenting. Otherwise, the whole episode would just be about two kids under tablets the whole time. Then the batteries die. Then they're bored. So it's like, yeah, this is good. I told you I packed them. Now it's not a good time for me. Oh, <laughs> such good time. Yeah, but look. No, okay. Well, that's a hundred dollar bucks, please. Okay. Oh, yeah. Now I'm making good times. Oh. Where are they going? They're going to the big peanut. <gasps> the big peanut. I want to go to the big peanut. I really, I mean, with a, with a picture like that, I really want to see the big peanut now. But Chili has a good, yeah, Ch Chili's got a good reason. It's like, yeah, yeah, we're, the travel's going slow, but look at the good memories having, look, happening in the back seat. That's adorable. The what? The big peanut. <laughs> Why aren't we going to the big peanut? True. It's just, also, just Bingo and the giant but shades, the though. Big Big peanut, okay. big peanut. Big peanut. <laughs> oh, come on, Bandy. You've been called a good dog. Come on, that's got to be sweet right there. Also, what happened to one of the things on the hat? It just fell off. Imagine getting hit by that thing. But yeah, that's a that I would I would like I want to see a big peanut like that though. I take a picture in front of it and be like, "Yep, that's me and the big peanut right there." Look at that goofy smile. It's a pretty big peanut, isn't it? <laughs> it's going over that. It is. Would you like a big peanut sticker? Aww. Oh, yes, oh, so no. polite. A collection. <laughs> that's so sweet, though. Aww. Is the worker doll? <laughs> <laughs> Is that only does? <laughs> That's my favorite character right there. Worker dog who just stands there and flips the sign. He's my favorite. <laughs> this is This is a this is a too real episode basically. A road trip with a family, kids get bored. You can either give them a tablet and that's it. The episode would have been boring if they were only just playing tablet games, but yeah, basically everything that happens on a road trip can happen. Basically, there's road work being done, the kids got to use the bathroom, you have to make a lot of stops, but at the same time, you're trying to get a good spot at the road, at the campsite. But also, don't forget to make some good memories along the way. Like, yeah, the trip slowed down, but the girls are having fun. They're playing a new game. And also, you got to see the big peanut. And, yeah. 
making good memories along the way. So it's part of me understands that Bandit wants to get to the campsite as soon as possible, but the trip, the journey is also important. The destination is important, but the journey is also just as important. The journey will be remembered for the new game for realizing there's a table this entire time. For seeing the big peanut. A lot of good memories on a road trip. But yeah, this is a very good episode. It's a very nice episode. I hope you enjoyed it too. And if you did, please don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. Let me know in the comments below. Tell me about your road trip experience. Any rememberable road trip experiences you had? Let me know. For me, my most memorable one was here in the water that's it either way catch you next time